Hey everybody, Joe here from Dark Animals and today I'm reviewing set 76277, War Machine Mech Armor. This set has 154 pieces and is yet another mech, though I have to say that this one might be the best one so far. This mech does make the most sense as it's basically a very large version of War Machine's suit. The feet are on ball joints but the knees can't bend which limits the poseability a bit. We also get some ball joints at the hips and the waist can be rotated thanks to a pin in the middle. I really like how the arms are built up. Both of them are on ball joints at the shoulders and both hands have articulated fingers that reveal these cool red repulsors. The only downside of all that arm bulk is the fact that this piece blocks the range of movement. The arms also feature not one, but three stud shooters. And where does Rhodey store all his ammo? Well, on his back of course, in this backpack that clips onto the mech. I also appreciate the addition of the silver hose piece that runs from the hip to the right hand shoulder. On the chest we get this nice printed 2x2 tile of the arc reactor and the cockpit area can easily open to place your figure. And the figure we get is Colonel James Rhodey Rhodes aka War Machine. I love the color scheme for this figure that introduces a little bit more light grey into the mix. His feet, legs and torso printing are all excellent and the new helmet piece also features a fantastic face print and of course it can be opened up to reveal Rhodey. We also get an extra hair piece if you prefer him without the helmet. But I do wish he had the red heads up display printing as he did in the older figures. I can't believe I'm saying this but this is actually a good looking set. It's nice and bulky and I like the inclusion of all the weapons. My biggest issue is with the lack of bendy knees and elbows but that's a general issue with all these mechs. Anyways, let me know what you thought about this set in the comments and please consider liking and subscribing to the channel if you like this review and what we do. And as always, thanks for watching.